So as we know that in each and every term that we are going to have, we are going to consider the topics that we need to work with, what you need to prepare. So this is our term three uh, that we are going to work with. And in this uh, term, what you're going to be working with is the first part. You're going to be given an assessment that you're going to work with, with which is a project. With that, it must cover what you did from term one up to term three. And uh, from that part, also, we are going to be working with algebraic expressions, which is the major part uh, that we are going to be having, working with your algebraic expressions, what you need to know, how to work out, add and subtract like terms in algebraic expressions, multiplying integers and monomials by a monomial, a binomial or a trinomial. Divide the following uh, by integer or a monomial. So we're going to have uh, these typical questions uh, the introductions on how you're supposed to have this in the first part of your week. Then also, you are going to be working with algebraic equations. Remember your equation solving for X, whereby you're solving for the unknown value that you are given. So what you're going to need is to use substitution in equations to generate tables of ordered pairs extend solving equations to include using additive and multiplicative inverses. Also working or using the laws of exponents. You are going to, uh, meaning to say, uh, you must have a recap. Can you have a recap on this part, on your laws of exponents? Because we are going to need that part as you are simplifying, as you are solving your equations. All right. Then the other part that you are going to work with is the geometry of straight lines, which is week five, week six. You are supposed to work, uh, realize or recognize and describe pairs of angles formed by perpendicular lines, intersecting lines, parallel lines, cut by a transversal. So we're going to talk about that. Then solving problems. And these problems, we are supposed to solve geometric problems using the relationship between pairs of angles described above. Using any of this part, is it from perpendicular lines? Is it from the parallel lines? And the last part that you are going to have is the geometry of 2D shapes, where you need to classify the classifying of 2D shapes, identify and write clear definitions of triangles in terms of their size and angles, then distinguishing between equilateral triangles, isosceles, isosceles triangles, and also right angle triangle. You need to know these types of triangles as you are working uh, with this part. They're also going to talk of the constructions and classifying of these shapes that we are given. Uh, so that means we shall have this as the major part of our term, which is the last part, as you can see, even in terms of the time that we are going to take in this one, we're going to take a lot of hours. And also that is three weeks approximation working with this, 12.5 hours working with this. Then the last part, you are going to have a revision then do not forget that formal assessment task for the test that you are going to have. And all, take note, all term three topics, all term, them, there's up all of them. So please do revise so that you do not uh, get uh, anything uh, out of hand. You must be able to answer whatever that you're given, whatever question that you are given, you must be able to attempt that question because you have worked with that all along. So these are the major parts that we are going to have. So please let us try to revise. You can see we do not have much time left. So from now we shall be working with our topics, revisions. So let us know uh, from the topics that we shall be working with. On the comment section, let us talk about uh, what or the areas that we can consider or that we can work with as we are revising. But for now, that is it from Zone African Motives till we meet again.